six months after Superstorm Sandy hammered the Jersey Shore, destroying homes and businesses along the coast, residents face yet another challenge, increasing flood insurance premiums. This legislation which I've introduced essentially takes the federal flood insurance premium increases and extends it to eight years at 12.5% a year. Lobiondo says his legislation will ease the immediate financial impact to shore residents. Under the 2012 Bigart Waters Flood Insurance Reform Law, flood insurance premiums are set to rise by 25 percent each year for four years to reach actual cost of full risk coverage. Congressman Lobiondo introduced legislation in Brigantine today that he says will lessen the impact of the rising flood insurance rates. Lobiondo's legislation would apply nationwide. Congressman John Runyon is co-sponsoring the bill. When, when you look at the uh yeah, the industry here and a lot of it, you know, a lot of it relates to tourism dollars. It's a $34 billion a year industry we have here in Jersey and it's, uh, it's, going, to, uh, it's going to take a hit this season. And anything we can do to, to lessen the burden to our, uh, our, our uh, businesses and our homeowners here is, is going to help us. Flood insurance costs aren't the only concern in shore communities like Brigantine. Mayor Phil Gunther says the city is working to make changes to the advisory base flood elevation maps. People are trying to rebuild after Sandy. Uh, some homes need to be raised and the construction type will vary by uh, the zone that the home is in. So the homes that have been placed in a V zone would need to place their homes on pilings, which is uh, very expensive and uh, logistically almost impossible uh, with the lot sizes that we have in Brigantine. Mayor Gunther says 25% of Brigantine's homes were placed in a V-zone, about 2,200 houses. It was one of the topics Congressman Lobiondo discussed with FEMA Administrator Fugate when they met three weeks ago. Mr. Fugate promised, guaranteed, assured me that they would take Brigantine and any other municipality and work with them to get to a final map that is in agreement with both FEMA and more importantly, the local elected officials and the residents who are going to have to live with these new maps. Congressman Lobiondo will travel to Washington, D.C. today. He'll meet with other lawmakers in an effort to gather bipartisan support for the legislation. For NJ Today, I'm Lauren Wonko in Brigantine.